See, if you go out and you buy a house, and let's say you're a veteran like I am, and you go out and you're you decide you're gonna buy a five hundred thousand dollar home or five million dollar home, it doesn't matter. Thankful, thankfully for us veterans, Trump, who was pro-veteran, uh, made it so we can buy houses using our VA and not have a limit. See, when they first created the VA program back in the 40s, they put a limit on how much of a house a veteran could buy. And for almost 80 years, all of the Democrat presidents, all of the Republicans, all of them prior to Donald Trump did absolutely nothing to help us veterans be able to get into house. Donald Trump changed that. Whether you like him or not, I'm very thankful for what he did for the veteran community. He made it. So if you're a veteran, you can buy any house in any neighborhood at any dollar amount. Before, if you were a veteran, you could only buy a house in a subpar neighborhood. You couldn't buy a house in a nice neighborhood. You had to go to the neighborhood that people don't necessarily want to live in. And so veterans just didn't use their VA benefits for it. That's why I never used it before is because I didn't want to live in the slums. But up until 2019, you had to. So Trump changed it. And now you could buy any amount. You can buy a $50 million mansion if you want in Beverly Hills. You can buy a $100 million mansion now with your VA. What does that mean? You can actually buy a $100 million house right now under the VA program with no down payment. Is that cool? Thank you, Donald Trump, for doing that. Because enabled us veterans now to be able to use our VA. So if you are a veteran, or let's say that you're not, and you're just do, you're going to do some other type of loan, you're going to do FHA, and you're going to put three and a half percent down, or you're going to do agriculture and put nothing down, or <clears throat> you do a 95.5, which you put 5% down, whatever it is, FICO does not care how much you owe on the house versus what the original loan balance was. So for example, you go out, you buy a million dollar house, you put no money down. The original balance is a million dollars. The balance owed today is a million dollars. And next month, it'll be a couple thousand dollars less after you make your payment. FICO doesn't care about that. 